We are at the Mesa Marlin Raceway for the 22nd race of Season 2 of the SCR Highway Mo Dash Truck Series. The 2 of Keenan Bush will be leading us to the green flag. Starting beside him is the 87 of Andrew Croach. Points leader Marcus Sanchi will be starting in the 9th spot. His closest challenger, Al Legacy, will be starting in the 11th spot. Rest of the starting lineup. Only 33 trucks. Of course, that's all the full-timers here. The part-timers, they did not. It's not a DNQ. They did not disqualify or did not qualify. They're just not here because we can't fit all 40 trucks. So, you know, just full-timers. <clears throat> the driver who won this race... Actually, we've had two previous races here at Mesa Marlin in the Truck Series. Uh, John Racer won the first event. And Aiden Shepard won the second. I'm pretty sure both those drivers are not in this series. No, they're not. All right. <clears throat> 22nd race of the season, number 22 out of 24. So we got two races left in season two Phoenix and Las Vegas. Will the streak continue? We have had 21 races in a row with a different winner, with AJ Jones winning the last race at Sears Point. So Keenan Bush trying to become the 22nd different winner this season. And without any further ado, here's the command to start this race. Drivers, start your engines! Hopefully it'll be a fun race today. Probably not, because it's a short track. <clears throat> Trucks are rolling off. Looks like no one's having any problems yet. A packed track. A packed crowd. A packed field. Oh, we got a problem with the six, I believe. Or is it the three? No. Nope. Alright. Pace truck is in. <clears throat> and we are racing for the third time in series history at Mesa Marlin. There's the green for the 22nd time this season. Tina Bush leads off into turn number one and to turn number two. Andrew Croach of our huge run on the outside. And it's unsponsored 87 truck. But Keenan Bush is going to try and lead the first lap. And he does. So Keenan Bush leads the first lap. 29 laps to go. Kyle Mitz trying to go for third. Around Sebastian Torres. And Kyle Metz will try to complete the pass in turn four. <clears throat> As there's the other, there's the other Croach family member, Caleb Croach. Trying to move up. Unsponsored vehicle, so is Evan Rudd. So we got a lot of unsponsored trucks. Oh, battle for the lead. Andrew, uh, no, this is, yeah, Andrew Croach trying to pass Keenan Bush. Andrew won the season opener at Homestead, Miami. He's trying to double down here in Mesa Marlin. Andrew takes over. So we got a lead change. There's Caleb Croach. There's Evan Rudd. There's Zachary Fitzwater in the 80 truck trying to move up. There's our points leader, Marcus Sanchi. And then there's his championship rival, Al Legacy. So right now, Sanchi will keep the points lead because he's in front of Al. Andrew Coach leads another lap. Keenan Bush is trying to get back around him. <clears throat> of course, Andrew. We've already discussed him. He's won a race in the truck series. Keenan Bush has not. In fact, uh, Keenan Bush is trying to become one of the seven drivers to win in both the Bush and truck series. <clears throat> if he can try and get a win in the next three races. Oh, caution is out. I just noticed that. <clears throat> Looks like the 15, Riley Spurley 2, has spun out. And turn 3. So he went a pretty good distance without a caution. 7 laps to be exact. The 87, Andrew Croach is a race leader. We'll take a look at the first caution of the day. 
So the 15 Raleigh Sperly Tube, one of the seven drivers who have won in both the Truck and the Bush Series. Racing with Derek Edison. Sperly Tube cuts down, trying to go underneath the 0-2. But there's not enough room, and Derek Edison comes up the track. And, yeah. Spins out Raleigh Sperly Tube. You got two former race winners this season battling for position. And there you see the red flag close in pit lane. And Riley Spurley 2 spins out, but is able to keep his truck rolling. So this will be a one truck incident. We This will be a quickie caution. So we will take it back to the restart. And we are back. No one is out of the race as of yet. So we still have all 33 trucks. In this field, Andrew Croach is still our race leader. Second is Keenan Bush. Third, Caleb Croach. Fourth, Evan Rudd. Fifth, points leader, Marcus Sanchi. Pace truck is in. And we are back to racing here at Mesa Marlin. Andrew looking to give the Croach family their fifth win of the season. Caleb right on the back bumper of Keenan. Whoa, contact. Oh, God. No. Driver's avoiding. There's no caution, and Andrew pulls away big time. Wow. Jonathan Reigns is now in second. Fitzwater's in third. And Luke Rainey's in fourth. Wow, that was uh, something, I guess you could say. And Al Agassi's losing a lot of spots because of this. So, Keenan Bush, who was battling for second, is now back to seventh due to contact. And Caleb is in fifth, so he lost four spots too. And Andrew has a four second lead. Wow. I've never had that happen before. Battle for fourth. Kevin Rudd trying to move up in his unsponsored vehicle. He's got two more chances to get a win before he has his first one this season. Oh, caution is out. I just noticed that. Looks like the 16. That is not what Andrew wanted. He had a 3.8 second lead. And it's all gone now. Andrew is our race leader. We'll take a look at the second caution of the day. So, the six of Oscar Isaac, who won several races ago at North Wilkesboro, racing with Nick Kennedy. Kind of just like Keenan Bush and uh, Caleb. Kennedy gets on the left side of this truck and spins out Oscar Isaac. Goes up the truck and Keith, Keith Stevens, hard impact to the rear end of the number six truck. And then, bam, the 75 MA Croach gets a lot of damage to the front end of his vehicle. Everyone else is able to avoid. So we have a three, well, four truck incident in turns one and two for our second caution of the day. We'll clean this mess up and we'll take you back to the restart. We are going to restart this race with nine laps to go. The 94 Jimmy Potter is out due to a broken camshaft. The 75 MA Croach and the 16 Kev Keith Stevens is out due to the accident we just had. Andrew Croach is our race leader. Second is Jonathan Reigns. Third is Zachary Fitzwater. Fourth, Luke Graney. And fifth, Caleb Croach. And we're back to racing at Mesa Marlin. Can Andrew Croach hang on for his second truck series win? He got a huge jump on Jonathan Reigns. Not sure what happened there. As Caleb Croach goes around Luke Rainey. Jonathan Reigns trying to close in on Andrew. This would be very big for Andrew. He does not have a sponsor for this race. His main sponsor, Bell South Mobility only sponsors him for the main races and this ain't the main race so if he does good today he should have a uh, sponsor in the next two races seven laps to go does anybody have anything for him Jonathan Reigns is trying to close in so is Zachary Fitzwater but it's mostly single file Fitzwater goes wide here comes Caleb trying to put the Croach family one and three as of right now the Croach family are dominating the truck series 
if Andrew keeps going the way he's going, they're going to have five wins in one season for the Croach family. Still green. Five laps to go this time by for Andrew, and the streak will be broken. The new streak will be 21 races in a row with a different winner. And the person who broke the streak will be Andrew Crouch. Well, depending on if he can get by the next four laps. Four laps to go. We do have an option of a green white checkered if anything happens. Luke Rainey is trying to go past Caleb Crouch, and he does. So Rainey up to third. He's a former winner at Nashville. Zachary Fitzwater moving up to fourth, trying to go for third. Nope. Three laps to go this time by for Andrew. He's got a 1.3 second lead. Two to go this time by. Zachary Fitzwater trying to go for third. Gives him a little bump. Not enough. Two laps to go. And if a caution comes out between now and the white flag, this race will go to green white checker. So Andrew just hoping, praying, please, no caution. And turn number four. This race is official. White flag, one lap to go for Andrew Croach. Well, he took advantage of Keenan Bush and Caleb Brecken. And he's going to lead the majority of this race. And the streak is over. Alpha turn number four. Andrew Croach will win here at Mesa Marlin despite a truck stalling on the front stretch. So here are your race results. Andrew Croach scores his second win of the season. Second is Jonathan Reigns. Third, Luke Rainey. Fourth, Zachary Fitzwater. Fifth, Caleb Croach. Sixth, Evan Rudd. Seventh, Sebastian Torres. Eighth, Jay Jefferson. Ninth, Keena Bush. And tenth, Al Legacy. I know it shows that drivers are lapped down, but we actually had 28 drivers finish the race on the lead lap. Cam was one lap down because he was stalled on the front stretch on the last lap, and then Oscar Isaac was two laps down. So... 28 finished on the lead lap. Well, the streak is over. It lasted 21 races with a different winner. Andrew Croach broke that streak today with his second win of the season, and we will take you to victory lane with Andrew Croach right now. Here are your point standings after the 22nd race of the season. Marcus Sanchi continues to hold the point lead. He has a 27-point lead over Al Legacy. Third is Jonathan Reigns, 56 points back. Fourth, Connor Thunder, 100 points back. And fifth, Keith Stevens, or Kevin Stevens, however your name is supposed to be, 120 points behind. Sixth is Kevin McHugh, 159 points behind. Seventh, Jay Jefferson, 167, I mean 165. Eighth, AJ Jones, 174. So as of right now, we have eight drivers that can mathematically win the championship with two races to go. Ninth is Rodney Croach and tenth, Caleb Croach. Eleventh, Oscar Isaac. Twelfth, Luke Rainey. Thirteenth, Alexander Rowe. Fourteenth, M.A. Croach. Fifteenth, Zachary Fitzwater. Sixteenth, Sebastian Torres. Seventeenth, Cole Nixie. Eighteenth, Grayson Hayes Vidu. Nineteenth, Jacob Bishop. And twentieth, Andrew Croach, who just won at Mesa Marlin and became the first driver to win twice in Season 2 of the Truck Series. Twenty-first, Greg Lee. Twenty-second, Evan Rudd. Twenty-third, Cam Nixie. Twenty-fourth, Tony Newman, 25th, Keenan Bush, 26th, Jack Legacy, 27th, Joe Jefferson, 28th, Max Anderson, 29th, Derek Edison, and 30th, Nick Kennedy. 31st, Riley Spurley Tube, 32nd, Jimmy Potter, 33rd, Kyle Metz, 34th, Colin Dryberg, 35th, Brian Fox, 36th, Eli Bright, 37th, Tim Randolph, 38th, Nia HPK, 39th, Charlie Foos, and last in points, Bulldog 67, and 40th in points. So that is your point standings after the 22nd race of the season at Mesa Marlin. We will see you next at the 23rd race of the season at Phoenix. And until then, keep the hammer down, and we'll see you at the track.